What role does diversity play in shaping your own leadership style? So one of the things, I remember when I used to hire, I used to look for people that were like me, that I could connect to, and it's a natural thing that we do. We talk to people, and when they're very similar to us, we're like, oh, I like you. You know, you, you think along the way I think. And I remember I had a manager who said to me, I said, you know, I love this person. We got along. We had a great conversation. And she said to me, but does she really compliment you? And I hadn't thought about that. I hadn't just like, does that person need to compliment me? I just like them. You know, does it, does it matter? <laughs> she seems like she can do the job, and she seems like she's like me. And I think it's a tendency we have is we, we hang around people that are similar to us. We like people that are, have, we have commonalities with. And I think you have to step back a little bit when you're trying to surround yourself with people. It is surrounding yourself with people that have kind of the values and beliefs that you have to some extent, but it's also understanding that you're gonna learn a lot from people that have different perspectives. Uh, so for me, I have to stand back a little bit and think of, I mean, it's not diversity in terms of skin color or just gender. Their diversity of mindset too is critical. So uh, I, I feel like I've, as I'm working through and doing a lot of the entrepreneurial work that I'm doing, I need to step back and find people that are a little bit different. One example is I have a, a MindWorks, which is my stress management business, and I, I'm actually now partnering with people. And I was a little mixed at first because I'm used to doing it where I go in and I can do whatever I want. I can go in and teach any sort of course with my own, only what I think. And what I loved is I started partnering with people that have kind of different, they go about it different ways and they do it different ways. And initially I thought, well, wait, I don't know if I want to do that because they're going to do something different. Um, and what if that's not something I agree with? And the reality is, is I need to step back from that and say, that's even better. That's going to be great that they're going to be able to bring in a different perspective. And some people are going to be able to relate a little bit better to what they're saying. And some people might relate to what I'm saying. Um, and then the reality is, is I'm going to learn something along the way in that process. So it's always, it's always thinking about that, you know, we can always learn something new from somebody.